Welcome back guys, we've just anchored up near Bommy, get some burley, some bait, there's no one out here, bit worrying but the conditions are actually not too bad, people panic, let's get into it. Right, so Jones is on, you want to call it? That's why I'm, I guess it's a skippy oak. You need a land in there or? Probably tighten your drag just slightly. Snapper. Is he a snapper? Oh, beautiful! Ooh, 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 ooh. Hang on, you're legal! Woo! Hang on! <laughs> there we go! Alright, that's probably the biggest one on the boat so far. Oh no! Alright, we've got the super hook. 43 centimetres. 43 centimetres, it's actually a nice chunky little fish. Well, there you go, mate. <laughs> yeah, okay. day, eh? That's pretty good. You can take a picture. Okay, my friend. We'll see you when you're uh, a few more centimetres bigger. Yeah, all good. He swam away. <laughs> all right. Bit of a fish on the circle hook. Muley. Nothing that big, I think. Bit of colour there. Might be a skippy. Yep. Oh, no, skippy. Oh, man. <laughs> now, that's... That's not fair. <laughs> At least the skiffy will be a bit more glory. Oh, we've got the right species. Put it that way. Thanks, mate. Oh, what happened here? We've got the right species, but they weren't the big ones. Or even a few skippy. So that this is here just happened. <laughs> That's a perler. That's not a bad whiting. That's a King George whiting, mate. That's a price fish. All right. Well, looks like we're going for them. <laughs> Better go with the uh, the rig for it, mate. Fine specimen. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. Lovely. Look at the sun in the background, they good. Well done. Alright, so James is on again. How's it feel? Yeah, it's a fair bit of weight there. Good one? Alright. Could be a stingray. Not going very fast. Yeah. Let's have a look. Well, it's moving around, it's a fish. <laughs> you only got small hooks, so we can't expect too big, but. You never know, you can get that legal snapper that I've been hanging out for. Woo! That's a stingray. <laughs> Enjoy the fight, mate. <laughs> no, the... Oh, he's growing, isn't he? <laughs> All that effort. Yeah, they're, they're good fun, but they, they chew up a lot of your time. Yeah, that's another fish in that. It's giving you value for money. Oh, that's good. So here's the mystery fish. Oh, well done. Now, see around here. Maybe I've caught one before, like that. And, uh, Someone said they're not bad on the tree. Still poor James. Oh, Jesus. Let's cut you. Let him go. Let him go. Let him okay. go for another day. Yep, yep. You'll cut, you'll, um, cut your hand like I did. A bit of action on the high seas, eh? <laughs> well done, mate. Good fight, huh? <laughs> I need a rest, though. <laughs> it needs a rest. Yeah, no, the good workout. <laughs> Nothing great. Ah, oh, flatty. Oh. oh yeah, a bit of boom boom. 
I call it a whiting. What do you reckon, James? <laughs> oh, yeah, beautiful. A fine specimen. That's great. Bit of consolation. You know, uh, my feelings towards these fine fish. Absolutely beautiful, they are. Awesome. Need a little whiting. A little whiting. Oh, that man, that's a good size. Good size, man. I reckon we'll um, anchor. So hard to hook up. Probably the bait's too big, you know, that. Yeah, you can't. Come on, it's got to be. There we go. Bit of a warm. That's better. Yep, awesome. So we're going to anchor to get ourselves a nice feed of whiting. Beauty. Okay, now we're cooking. Yeah, all right. Yeah, beauty. So we're on to them. Oh, James is on too. That's a good one. Good size. Oh, and again. Woo! Whiting mayhem here. So, we need an anchor. I'll put in a bit of burly. I dropped the burly pot all the way down to the bottom. That's where the fish are. Hanging around. Being efficient. Give you a good soft skippy this one. Yeah, it's a good skippy. There you go. That's a better one. Fish. It's such a privilege to catch the whiting. And also, just a great bonus when you're trying to go for the bigger fish on the on the reef, and we're just about to head back to port. I so said, let's stop and have a look, and we're starting to get a real nice feed of whiting. So that's just great. <laughs> Put another skippy. Another skippy. Silvery colour. There you go. Yeah. There you go. Look at his mate. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, that's a good one, eh? Lovely. Oh, what a... Uh... <laughs> that's why. Right on the door, put him in the back. Value for money and fighting capabilities. Oh yeah. A bit more smaller. Let's let this guy go. Oh no wonder. Double. Double That's trouble. trouble. <laughs> Double trouble. Yeah. There you go. Skip your manners. Look at that. Here you go. Another oh, yeah, another double. See? Another double. Oh, yeah. There's another decent skippy. I mean, I'm getting weak, they're just feeling heavy, you know? <laughs> Alrighty guys, we're out of here. Because there's a huge front coming our way. Not dangerous, it's just we don't want to get rained on. We've already been out here for a good couple of hours and had a really good fish catch. It's just saying that it's just good fun getting, you know, ones and twos of the smaller fish. And we've done pretty good. So we've got a few skippy, a few whiting. But this ponds of King George this is absolutely great. Haven't seen one of these for a while. So that's terrific. 
Yeah, all good stuff there, James. Done well, mate. Let's go. Oh, oh look at him. <laughs> Scared the crap out of me. How are you, mate? Got a fish? Got a fish? Here. Yeah. Yeah, I love those hooks. Yeah. <laughs> Here you go, buddy. Yeah, he's Go around of you. I see a lot of fire. <laughs> anyway, let's get into it. Cook up. It is winter, cold, and we're going to do the fish. So we've got a few whiting, a few skippy. We're going to flip them up and cook something very traditional for a winter dish. That's a fish chowder. Right, so there's whiting are pretty small. Don't expect to get much meat off them, but I gave the rest to my brother in law. He can feed his family. I just wanted to keep a couple. Absolutely beautiful flesh for whiting. Then we've got the skippy. Probably not the best filleting knife, but I like it because it's very sharp. We're starting to get used to it. Just took the skin off on those ones. There we go. There you have a nice skippy foot. I'll do the rest here and we'll get stuck into the into the cook. Alright, so I've got my whiting fillets, I'm just gonna cut them in one in half. They are very delicate. I left the skin on for a reason. And the skippy chevelli pieces into small bite sized pieces. Now I didn't have much fish, so I ended up getting a frozen flit one as well for Skippy, just to supplement the dish. Great. One onion. Okay, nice and diced up into pieces. So I think vegetables, carrots, peas, corn, beans, and a bit of potato. I'm gonna add another fresh potato. Fresh potato. Potato, onion, fish, vegetables. Cooking on the fire tonight. Why not? Do a pan with some oil on it. Throw on the onions. Well, that smells so good. Fresh garlic cloves. I'm going to put in the uh, potato. Bit of water, that can simmer. This is going to cook for, for about 10 15 minutes until the potatoes are nice and soft and the veggies. Hopefully, I've got them nice and high. Right, so it's been at it for a good 10 minutes now and the potatoes are nice and soft. All the veggies are pretty well cooked up. Just simmering along. Definitely need some salt. My salt shaker died. A nice uh, pepper. Then we're going to pour in some thickening cream. Uh, cooking cream, I think. Yeah, thickening cream. 
bit that much. Got a good stir. That should come nice and thick. Hmm. Okay, so that's bobbling away pretty good. Ooh, that's delicious, that's exactly what we want. Kind of thicken up a bit. Now come that in the fish. Let him on the fish. Just like that. That won't take long to cook at all. Same time we've got some chopped up chives. And a few, a few sprigs of thyme. It's looking at the first class. Top off a bit more chives. I reckon she's right. Right for the taste. It looks really awesome, and I'm just going to try it out of the spoon here. I've got to bring this inside for the crew and grab. There you go. It looks like a whiting. Let's give it a shot. Oh, it smells beaut. It smells really good. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Mmm. That's spot on. A cold winter's night near a fireplace after a good day's fishing out there on the ocean that is a way to, to really enjoy a nice feed fish chowder dom style with fresh tucker mate we love it just want to say thanks very much for all the subscribers for supporting me phenomenal support thanks so much guys and for the new people who watched the show all the way to the end i appreciate it make sure you subscribe if you like to i appreciate it and uh we'll see you next time dom appetit Mm -mm. This is just a river. There you go. Lovely. Mm. Fish, tucker, fish, tucker, fish, tucker, man. Fish, tucker, fish, tucker, the fish, tucker, man.